What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming here with some Iron Banana. And here's another top five video for you guys. Thank you guys so much for the for the support you guys gave in the last top five video. Honestly, it means a lot to me. And I thought why not give you guys some more tips and tricks to help you improve your gameplay in Destiny, make this game a little bit easier. And thank you Bungie, because you guys are really helping us out by allowing us to light level so fast. If you guys don't know, the best way to get your light level up to 385 plus is Iron Banana right now. Get in there. But I'm gonna give you guys top five reasons as to how you guys can win in iron banner now number one i'm gonna give you an extra reason it goes without saying a lot of these reasons actually go without saying but if you're new to the game hey you know i can understand if you guys already know these reasons go preach them go go tell it to people somewhere else all right or share this video anyways so number one before number one so let's say zero go find a team don't go into iron banana by yourself you will die you will hate your life you will hate destiny um you're gonna get shit on especially if you match up against a team of six on the other team now this video you know i was literally waiting until we matched up against a team of six because we run as a team of six but we play with viewers from our stream check out the description below if you want to play with us so we play with viewers we're like no we can't play a, put a game up without actually playing a team of six so here we are playing a team of six they look really good um we pretty much put the works on them but regardless let's start with the official five reasons okay number one is your weapon build pulse rifle hand cannons scout rifles that seems to be the meta currently now check it out what is it it's october 5th 2016 the meta will change because bungie will nerf and buff guns here and there you want to keep that in mind but also know I'm using the palindrome right now. This is a vendor hand cannon. You guys, anybody can go buy it. Go get 150 legendary marks and go buy this gun. All right, it's a really good rolls on it. It's working really well. My secondary is a shotgun. Why am I using a shotgun? Because it's freaking supremacy. You can get a sniper kill from across the map, but if nobody goes and picks up that damn crest, it don't freaking matter, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know. Anyways, reason number two, character composition. I said this in the raid video. This is probably one of the most important things that you guys can do. Now, it's not so much so important in Crucible as it is in raids, um, but I will say this, all right? Play on the character that you are most comfortable with. Now, if you want to win, let's say you have three characters, you're having a hard time winning games. If you don't win games, you don't get XP, you know? If you lose games, you get medallions, but if you don't win them, you can't claim them. So play on a character that you like, or play on a Warlock because they're freaking cheesy. It's unreal how good the Warlock is in this game. Now, every character has his, you know, ups and downs and all that, but it just seems that Warlocks have been favored from the get-go, in my opinion. Now, don't go all crazy in the chat if you guys hate me, all right? I love you. All right, uh, number three is light level enabled because that shit is freaking enabled in Iron Banner. All right, stop going in Iron Banner as a light level 350. You're not doing anyone any good. Now, I will say this. I was carrying people as a light level 348 in Trials, but that's different, all right? I, I, I'm i an idiot, all right? I don't have time to light level my character up all the way. This is for people that are trying to win and that aren't idiots. So get your light level up. Now, Iron Banner is the best way to get your light level up. I made a few videos. If you wanna get your light level up to at least 365, go do SIVA Heroic Strikes. After that, you can do raids. You can open up faction packages, um, crucible packages, vendor packages. They'll get your light level up as well. So get your light level up because if you're going up against a 380, 385, and you're a 350, bet money you about to get body shotted by a high impact sniper or just get long range mapped by a shotgun. You know it, I know it, we know it. If you join up on somebody's team and you're a 348, expect some hate mail. All right, don't be surprised. All right, so reason number four is understanding the map layout and spawns. Surprisingly, I saw quite a few maps in Iron Banner. You guys know Supremacy this time around. It'll be a different playlist next time. It's okay. Modify these reasons as the playlists change. But understanding the map layout and the spawns will always be important, all right? You wanna make sure that you understand where the other team is going to spawn, depending on where your team is. So for example, if your team is heavily on one side of the map, you can take a wild guess that the other team is gonna spawn across the map, all right? It's an algorithm or Bungie's configuration 
to just find the safest spawn point so you you don't get you know spawn killed but maps like exit is blue and smaller maps it's a lot easier to spawn kill in a 6v6 because the map is you know it's kind of difficult to fit that many people on one map so that doesn't mean go wander on the other side while your whole team is on the other side and you get your ass kicked because they all spawned on you definitely stay with your team that actually transitions me into the last reason the fifth reason as to how you can win games in iron banner and that is team mother king work all right i beat myself out no editing needed all right teamwork teamwork makes the dream work any freaking cliche quote you want to talk about there is no i in team all that shit it's iron banner all right it's iron banner team if once iron banner comes out in rumble go do what you want but don't be lone wolfing your way to the other team there was actually a part in this video where you saw me lone wolfing the shit out of myself and i was lucky enough to get a kill and trade with a crest but i still got my ass kicked it was a horrible move by me Hey, I'm a human. I make mistakes too. Learn from my mistakes. Do not go lone wolfing by yourself, okay? Destiny, especially in team environments where it's 6v6, you need to play as a team. Please play as a team. Stick with your teammates. Watch each other's angles. Do the bait and switch. God, the bait and switch is the greatest thing in the world. So what it is is you're in a standoff with the other team or just to say one-on-one. -on -one you just start shooting the guy he starts shooting you now maybe you can take him out but maybe you guys will trade right meaning he'll kill you and you'll kill him why don't you just step back let your teammate who is full health step up boom boom pow pow pew pew and that motherfucker's dead all right sorry for cussing regardless that bait and switch do a lot of things with this you want to make sure that oh another reason i'm going to add just because it's supremacy stop going for the motherfucking crest for no damn reason you know for damn well you didn't get a kill. You got two people in front of you. You could easily shoot them and help your teammates out. Your teammates are being good Samaritans and shooting people on the other side while you're going around being a greedy motherfucker, picking up. God damn it. I hate I hate this supremacy bullshit, especially in Rumble. God, anyways, man, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you guys liked it. Slap a like button if you did. I'm going to be coming out with some more videos, obviously. And as I come out with some more videos, make sure you guys come say what's up to us in our stream. The description below says it. Everything you need, we help in raids, trials, everything. We carry so many people to the lighthouse. We do it all the time. All right, reach out, baby. We love you. Thank you so much. I'm tired as hell. I'm going to bed. I got work in the morning, but I'm excited and I'm positive. You guys stay positive. Good luck with all your loot and I'll see you in the next video. Oh, join the TKO Nation clan. It's in the description below as well. We got over a thousand people. You guys can get raid people uh, and you guys can get iron banana people. Go get that rank five, baby. Peace out, baby. Bye, 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 bye. I'm way too hyper. What the fuck?